Lynx forward Olympian Napia Sakalier injures foot. Minnesota Lynx forward Napia Sakalier left Thursday's loss to the Connecticut Sun with a left foot injury. Collier was injured in the third quarter and did not return to the game finishing with nine points. Lynx head coach Cheryl Reeve said after the 78-73 defeat that she did not have an update on Collier who is part of the U.S. women's Olympic basketball team. Reeve is also the Olympic head coach. Collier a first-team All-WNBA selection in 2023 is averaging 20.0 points 10.2 points, rebounds and 3.7 assists this season for Minnesota, 14-6. The Lynx have lost three of their last four games since winning the Commissioner's Cup over the New York Liberty on June 25. The Lynx are back home Saturday to play the Washington Mystics and have four more games before the WNBA takes its Olympic break after the All-Star Game on July 20. The U.S. national team's first game in the Paris Olympics is against Japan on July 29 in a group stage matchup. Our Frank Schwab counts down his NFL power rankings grades each team's off-season solicits fantasy football advice and previews what the 2024 season might have in store for each team. Fred Zinke has a mix of pickups who offer immediate help or long-term upside for fantasy baseball managers. The July 4, 1923 heavyweight title fight between Jack Dempsey and Tommy Gibbons in Shelby, Montana stands out as one of the most economically disastrous events in boxing history. On today's episode of Zero Blitz Jason Fitz and Frank Schwab pitch which NFL teams have the best Mount Rushmores for every position group. In a viral social media post the employee claimed that club president Jill Ellis perpetuated an abusive environment which San Diego said was categorically false. Jake Mintz and Jordan Shusterman discuss the Cubs possibly being in trouble this season the problem with the Mariners offense James Wood making his debut remembering Orlando Sepita and Pirates superfan Saxboy joins the show. The newly built CPKC Stadium the first built specifically for a women's professional sports team has a capacity of 11,500. Iger and Bay will replace Reddit co-founder Alexis Ahanian as majority owner of the team which is worth a reported $300 million. Despite slugging 27 home runs this season Shahei Otani won't be participating in the 2024 Home Run Derby. LeBron James is sticking with the Los Angeles Lakers for the near future. Pete Carroll was a Seattle legend but a change was made.